What's happening people? Welcome to another video with All Source and we have got another Series 7 smartwatch. Just before I get started, make sure you follow me on one of the social media above as I always put sneak peeks on what to expect from All Source and as always, make sure you subscribe and also hit the bell notification so when I upload any video you'll actually be notified. So, here we have the Watch 7 Pro, it also came with this watch band, the stainless steel watch band magnetic one as well. Uh, we'll put that on later in the video put that aside so here we have the box as you can see watch 7 pro technology inspires life nothing much around the box comes in five different colors we've opted for the black version of course that you need to download uh, is well from this qr code which you scan on your smartphone and we have a bit of information not about the uh, the smartwatch but just uh, saying that it's not a medical device. A few trademarks and made in China as is everything else. So let's open this up, see what we get inside and let's check out the smartwatch. Here we have it. This is a 45 millimeter series seven smartwatch. Let's just take off the plastic and see what it's like. There we go. So as you can see with the design, it's pretty much similar to the Series 7. It's got a one slit, but I'm pretty half of it, well, three quarters of it is uh, fake, blocked off as you can see. And also another difference is it hasn't got the push buttons to take the watch band off. They just slide straight on and off from there. So yeah, let's switch it on and let's see what we have. It also has another screen protector, which we have here, which will take off. There you go. Uh, let's uh, see what it's like. So as you can see here, you've got animation watch face. Let's go into watch faces, hold the screen in. Let's see how much watch faces we have. One, let's start. yeah, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 28, I will call it, 28 watch faces. Which one is good? Which one shall we choose? So choose the moon. Let's go check that out. So yeah, that is a really nice watch. Look at the screen to body ratio. It's placed in the middle. So you've got one bezel all around, not like the previous smartwatches where you get a big bezel at the top, small bezel at the top and uh, same on the side. So it's placement is in the middle, which is good. Uh, let's swipe it down and let's see what we have. Well, that's, uh, swipe it down as you can see you have your shortcuts which is really cool so you've got eight shortcuts you got your bluetooth do not disturb uh, we'll take that off you got your lock screen which you can lock and put a passcode on you got your on and off button there you got your settings brightness which we have here and it's all slide as well which is good uh, you've got your bluetooth call and also your qr code to download the app now the touch sensitivity on the screen is really good this is the pro version watch 7 you can get the normal watch 7 which i have right here so if you want to see that let me know in the comment section below so it also has a split screen so all the apps that you've used come onto the bottom you got your uh, weather um, degrees and also your steps and time and date which is cool swiping it up it gives you your message notifications but you've got to connect it to your phone to receive notifications swiping it to the left you can get your show calls your heart rate so as we are on heart rate as you can see the Christmas flashing lights are going daft uh, let's just check to see if we actually get a uh, reading so let's go back 
and uh, let's see if we actually get a reading so pressing up the button you can see the graph going up and down um, it's actually not doing nothing but the screen goes off well we'll check it out once we change the settings so let's go into show cuts uh, screen time 60 seconds raise to weight let's just change that screen duration and yeah some brightness so all that is up let's go back and hopefully uh, we might get a, um, a reading on the heart rate so it just goes off and on no idea why so it just keeps going off we'll, ch we'll check that out later anyway uh, you've got your sleep and also you can add stuff which you have right here whether workout and music let's go back and as you can see here whether workout and music and you can add well you can only add them so pushing in the crown button will bring you to the menu interface so let's see how much many interfaces we have one two three four five six seven seven menu interfaces that is really good uh, let's go all the way to the top and it actually um remembers uh, when you actually uh, where you actually left off from so let's go you got your shut down settings will work up for system watch seven it doesn't say pro you got your brightness uh find phone messages timer uh stopwatch that is a really nice stopwatch there alarm clock uh you got your weather which needs to be connected workout you got your walking let's take that off and as you can see it goes straight back so you got your running climbing basketball uh, badminton football and yoga your music which you need to connect to your uh, device ecg i'm pretty sure that's the same as the heart rate but it just goes off with the screen even though i've changed it uh, well it's not doing it on the ecg but as you can see the lights have gone off message uh, me me measurement fail please remeasure so yeah um let's put it on an object and see if it actually works from there because some of the watches they have like a sensor a touch sensor on the bottom of the watch so if it touches an object it will actually give you a reading if it doesn't touch an object it won't give you a reading so as you can see we've got it on a box and you have the reading right there so this watch 7 pro has a sensor which detects that it's on an object and then it will give you a reading so it's a fake reading there but you know what these are like so as you can see i've took it off it's gave a measurement fail so uh, just goes to show don't be fooled by that so always check it on an object if it doesn't give you a reading then that uh, fair enough so yeah your blood oxygen blood pressure and heart rate are probably the same uh, breathe training and just play it there sleep monitor your data all your information your pedometer and steps calories you burnt voice assistant uh, you can that's siri activated or voice assistant on android uh, call records got to connect it contact person reset qr code and that is about it people so uh, it has got basic features no games and stuff like that because some smartwatches do have games but i've got to say the design's really good if you just want to use it for phone calls and uh, telling the time and stuff like that it's pretty good um i like the twitch sensitivity on it it's really good also uh, the design is same as the series 7 what i'm going to do now is connect it uh, download the app connect it to my phone and let's see what features we have while it's connected to the app the app you need to download is m active pro that one right there so let's uh, go into it uh, we need to put our bluetooth on and there we have it so here is what the app looks like let's push it up there so you've got your total steps at the top and your calories burn and the duration of your walk or whatnot calories sleep and sport record um, you got your sport mode which you have right here you can run indoor walk cycle you got your device which will connect and you've also got information what you can put about yourself onto here so let's go into device let's bind now let's go into the watch put the bluetooth on and as you can see here watch seven connecting so hopefully it should connect pair yes and yes allow notifications there we have it uh find watch it's just vibrating because it's on silent 
uh, message notifications you can toggle the message notifications on and off depending on which notifications you want but they're all on at the moment so we'll check that out later uh, bluetooth to take photo raise hand on the screen uh, that's just raise to wake uh, you got your watch reminder weather push alarm settings top contacts heart rate and firmware update doesn't say anything about uh the watch faces custom watch faces because a lot of people ask me if you can put custom watch faces on but it doesn't say anything about that so yeah as you can see device um we don't have it right there so when it comes to these smart watches you have to connect them twice so the first one being uh when you connect it from the device here all the information gets synced from the smart watch straight to your um your uh, app so your total step your calories burnt and everything but if you want to take photo as if you want to make phone calls and receive text notifications or app notifications you have to connect it twice from the settings now it's connected as you can see uh, you can actually make phone calls it has gone um yellowish orange on there so what i'm going to do now is break out my vivo v23 pro smartphone and i'm going to ring the number and we are going to see as you can see all sorts is coming up but uh, here we have the number on the screen so the name doesn't come up just the number so let's take that off and uh, yeah that is it ladies and gents that is the watch 7 pro smartwatch overall not a bad smartwatch pretty basic um not a lot of features on it but overall it's a decent smartwatch if you just want it to use or just to tell the time make phone calls or whatnot uh, but yeah like i said you can receive message notifications you can't reply back on text messages i've already tried it but it's just uh, receiving notifications you can actually do that on this smartphone but overall what do you think let me know in the comment section below uh, if you want to see any other other videos do let me know thanks again for watching and i'll see you again for another video